Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got pink skies and blue dragonflies. I've started off with Neltique's Formula 2 and this is Color Club and this one is called Miss Bliss. It's a beautiful pink linear hollow and I have topped it all off with posh fast drying top coat. I'm going to do some stamping. Today I'm going to be using this Born Pretty plate and this one is BP-74. And I'm going to use that little dragonfly image. Yep, that one right there. I'm also going to be using a little bit of Super Dry and you'll see why in, in a minute. And this is going to be the Clean Color Metallic Aqua that I'm stamping with. It's a regular polish and it's been drying pretty quick, so. I've got my Fabri Nail Scraper and my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper. And what I'm doing here is I'm doing a very super thin layer of the Super Dry. And that's to give my stamping a sticky kind of base to adhere to. Um, I had done some practicing with this polish and I was having some issues. And once I started putting down just a minute amount of the super dry it was sticking pretty well so I'm gonna try to remember that from here on out when I'm having some honorary stamping because I was having no trouble with pickup just getting it to stick to my nails so that worked out it was an easy fix and I'm gonna do the same thing on this one and I'm not even putting a real layer of this on it's almost like a dry brush of the super dry and these little dragonflies are just so cute. Love them. And I had been needing some hollow in my life. It had been a minute since I wore it, so I needed to wear something a little shiny and sparkly. And it had been a while since I wore pink, so I figured the two went hand in hand. We'll do some hollow and some pink. And these are just sticking so well. Love it. And I am cleaning that plate off in between with just some acetone and a cotton ball using my cotton claw. And I have used these clean color metallics many times before on other manicures and they are just really nice. The, the colors are so vivid and they just work really good for stamping. And I don't know how much they are now, but back when I got mine, they were rather cheap. Here we go. We're going to do this last one. Gonna get that little pinky caught up with everybody else. And voila. There we go. And I'm just using some tape and I'm happy to report that I was able to do all of my cleanup with the tape and this excess polish around my nails. Worked out really good. I always love it when I don't have to break out acetone or nail polish remover. That stuff's just popping off like a dream. Wonderful. Love me some nice, easy, quick cleanup. And here we go. We are finished. We are going to top this one off with some posh top coat and seal in those little dragonflies. And I have no smearing with this at all. There's, I didn't distort any of the dragonflies applying my top coat. <clears throat> Come on camera, focus. Come on. There we go. A little better. And I am still working on my lighting. I hope you guys will stick with me until I get it all straightened out. I have bought every kind of lamp and light and bulb and it's just, it's 
still an issue, so I am working on it. Get these all nice and top coated, a nice, decent top coat on them. And that pink right now does not look as pink as it really is. It's kind of looking washed out, but that's okay. And I have got a fuzzy on my stick and nail polish brush. Orange wood stick. Yay. Here we go. We're going to do this last one. And as usual, I would love to hear what you think about this one. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are. And that is all I have for you today. I hope you like it. And here is my swatch photo. And as always, I want to thank you for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.